May this happy moment be but the dawn of a long and wonderful life for you both. Edmund Dantes, you're under arrest by order of the Magistrate of Marseille. Arrest? Well, I must say, Dantes, you don't have the look of a traitor. Traitor? Did you have any personal contact with Napoleon when you were on Elba? Elba? Yes, I did. Well, we did. I was with the Count Mondego's son, Fernand, almost the entire time. He'll vouch for me. No doubt, but you said almost the entire time. Except for when Napoleon asked me to deliver a personal letter to a friend in Marseille. Well, that... it is for accepting that treasonous correspondence that you have been denounced by your own first mate, Monsieur Danglars. What? Now, did you deliver the letter? No, sir. Someone was supposed to find me. Have you read this? No, sir. I, I can't read. Well, Dantes, this is a letter to one of Napoleon's agents. It gives the times and the locations of the British beach patrols on Elba. Sir, I swear on my mother's grave. I had no idea he swore its contents were innocent. No. It's you that's innocent. Foolish and innocent. What happened? He asked me, did Napoleon tell you he was supposed to pick up this letter? I told him, I'm Mr. Clarion. And nothing more. Nothing. He burnt the letter and said I could go. Strange that a chief magistrate would burn evidence of a treasonous conspiracy. And then imprison the only man who was aware of Monsieur Clarion's connection to that conspiracy. Theophore's father was a colonel in Napoleon's army. Theophore wasn't protecting Clarion. He was protecting himself. Don La, who falsely said he saw Napoleon do him right. Mondego, who told Theophore I had it. And Theophore himself was sent me here. You know, if you find that you're not committed the crime, which you know, serve the center. God said, vengeance is mine. I don't believe in God. It doesn't matter. He believes in you. What is his name? His name? We should call him Zatara. They must suffer as I suffered. They must see their world, all they hold dear, ripped from them as it was ripped from me. You would need a better name than Tatara if you are to accomplish that. Then I shall become a count. Ladies and gentlemen, it is with great honor that I present to you with grace the Count of Monte Cristo. Greetings. Who are you? I'm the Count of Monte Cristo, but my friends call me Edmond Dantes. Dantes. Monte Cristo. Is your view full? You are under arrest for conspiracy to murder. You remember? Dantes. You have a fortune. A beautiful woman who loves you. Take the money, take the woman, and live your life. Stop this plan. Take what you have won. I can't. And I'm not supposed to want to be you. Whatever happened to you, you cannot make it right by staying here on this boat. Go. It's up to you. Why did you not come to me? Why did you not wait? You married the very man who betrayed... 
I told you that night on the rocks. Remember? That it would never leave my finger. And it never has. Why? No, why? If you ever loved me, don't. Don't rob me of my hate. It's all I have. Let it go, Elon. That plan lies within you. But God has offered us a new beginning. Go. Don't slap his hand away. Can I never escape him? No. He is in everything. I've only got one shot. It'll take more than that to stop me. Then I best put it where it will do the most damage. Edmond! Ah! Ah! Hey, Edmond! Hey, Edmond, don't go. You must end this. Even the priests will understand that. Now I couldn't live in a world where you have everything and I have Priest, this I promise you, and God, all that was used for vengeance, will now be used for good. So rest in peace, my friend.